Hey guys, it's Leah and it is the day before our Disney trip. We're so, so excited. But what am I doing at one o'clock in the afternoon, the day before we go to Disney? I am just starting to pack. <laughs> I'm so bad about procrastinating until the day before. It's just really hard for me to get it done before then, but It'll be okay, I'm a little bit stressed out, but I know it'll work out okay, I have a million things to do. My room is a wreck right now. I'm cleaning my sheets, as you can see, because why wouldn't you do that the day before flying to Disney, right? But I'll go ahead and show you guys what I have so far, which is nothing. All, I, all I've done is I pulled a bunch of stuff out. I have my suitcases out and some bags and things out from Target, just different stuff that we have to bring. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the start and the finished product when I'm finally done. It'll be interesting to see what time it is when I'm finally done. So it's one o'clock in the afternoon right now. So I pulled these two big suitcases out and then I'm also gonna use the kids' suitcases. And then this is just some stuff that I'm gonna start working on getting packed up. I'm gonna bring this bag, I think, for my carry-on. I'm not gonna use it in the park, so I think I'm just gonna use it for the plane. Bunch of stuff at Target that I actually just went out this morning to get for our trip. Well, I kind of hit my first dilemma here. So after we spend five days in Disney, we're going to Naples, Florida to visit my grandma and we'll go to the beach while we're there. So we are renting a car to drive drive down there and I was just going to bring these small booster seats for the kids, two of them. Well, I thought that two of them would fit in a big suitcase and I could just put both of them in one suitcase and put like our beach towels in there and it would be fine. Only one fits in a big suitcase. I can't get two to fit in there. So I do have one in this suitcase. I have some beach towels. And then this is beach stuff, like some buckets and shovels and sandcastle things that I got from Target. So I have that in there. But I guess I'm gonna have to put this booster seat in here. And that really stinks because I was only going to use this suitcase for my clothes and my things, but now I'm gonna have to bring another one. I mean, it works out because we're flying with Southwest and so each person can check two free bags. So I can bring an extra bag for my clothes, I guess. I'm just gonna show you guys some of the stuff that I have out here that I'm in the process of organizing. And like I said, I'm washing my bed stuff, so <laughs> excuse this. But um, these are some snacks and breakfast things that I'm gonna bring to have in the room and also in the car on the road when we're traveling from Orlando to Naples. So I have these two boxes of cereal bars and these are always good to have at Disney when you don't have like a breakfast reservation booked and you just want something small to eat before you leave your room. And then in this bag, I've been collecting different things around the house. So we have these made good granola minis, chocolate chip and mixed berry. I got these from Costco and these are actually really good. So I have some different packs of those. I've got Got some nuts, cashews, peanuts, and got some almonds in here somewhere. Um, I have some go go squeeze for the kids, different flavors, and then I have these Annie's fruit snacks and a bunch of these Costco granola bars. I think that's all I have in here as far as snacks go, and I'm gonna go ahead and try to organize this stuff. I had this Disney Parks bag from our last trip, so I just decided to use it, and I put some of the snacks in here for the plane, and I'm gonna put this in my carry-on. There's just a little bit of stuff in here, and then I'm starting to get some of this stuff together for my carry-on bag. I'm actually really afraid of flying, and I like to color. It's something that helps get my mind off of it. So I have these things here, and I mean, this stuff is for all of us to share, and the kids have things too, and I'll show you what's in their bags once I'm done with everything. And then some extra crayons, colored pencils. I really like this hand sanitizer spray. I got this from Amazon, and I feel like it works really well, so I'm gonna bring that. And I really need to redo my nails tonight before we leave. That's another thing that I really wanna do. So it's been about an hour and a half, and I'm just checking in, showing you my progress. Of course, there's Maggie. Um, okay, so I started on the kids' suitcases. I've got some stuff going here. The rest of their stuff is in the laundry, so I'll show you what they actually have once I have all of that stuff in. And then I've got some supplies and towels and the um, car seats and things in here. I haven't started on my actual clothes yet. And then I have some of our specialty outfits up on the bed, and I'm still kind of figuring out what I'm going to do with that. Okay guys, it's several hours later. We've eaten dinner and everything. Now I'm finally gonna do my suitcase and I've got all of my stuff laid out that I'm gonna bring with me. So first I have several bathing suits. Like I said, we're gonna also go to the beach after Disney. So I have a lot of different options. I don't know, I feel like it's too much, but I also like to bring a lot of bathing suits. That's like the one thing I like to bring a lot of for some reason. So I have this one top 
It has this really cute design. I think all of these came from Target. I just got these bottoms this year. These are really cute. This is like a high-waisted bottom and it has this little design on the side. But I thought these would look good with that top and also this one is really cute with this crisscross corset kind of a thing and off the shoulder. I really like this. <laughs> so those are my two piece and then I bought this one piece from Target that I really like and this is kind of like my more modest mom bathing suit that <laughs> I usually wear this when I take the kids to the pool here but I'm gonna bring this one to I showed this in the last vlog that I filmed but it's just this little oh wait this is a two-piece too right but it looks like a one-piece when I'm wearing it okay so those are all of the bathing suits I'm gonna bring these sandals I just got these from Target and these are so comfortable I really love these so I haven't worn them yet I just tried them on at the store and I really like them so that's why they're on the bed they're not dirty yet and these are all of my ears. Let's see, I'll start with the t-shirts. So the trackers are my favorite YouTube channel and I had to buy their merch. I feel like I need to bring it for this trip. It's perfect, right? So I have that t-shirt. I have this Lion King Hakuna Matata t-shirt and a Toy Story t-shirt. Sorry if it's kind of dark in here. I feel like it's dark and there's a lot of shadows, but it's basically nighttime now. So sorry about that. I have a light on though. Okay, and then I have this dress. See, I'm not exactly sure what I want to do. So I have these Pascal ears for our Magic Kingdom day, and I'm not sure if I want to wear this dress. Here's a better look of them together. This dress or this tank top with some shorts. I'm not sure yet, so I think I'm just going to bring both of those. And then I have this just simple black dress that I like, and this blue one that I think goes really well with either the Pixar ears or those blue floral ones. And I have two Marie dresses. This one came from Hot Topic. And then this one with the whole family. It's like a little skater dress. I have these two pairs of shorts. I have another one in the dryer right now. I think I'm only going to have three shorts to bring. I just don't wear shorts that often, so I only have three pairs, but I think I'll be okay because I have a lot of dresses too. So I'm going to try to pack this stuff up really, really small and fit it in this little suitcase. <laughs> here are some things that I have in here so far. I'm um, just some underwear, an extra bra. Uh, what is this? Oh, I like to sleep in boxer briefs and I've got some Under Armour shorts in there. This little purse that I got from my Bibbidi Bobbidi box, some hair stuff, and some more. Oh, these are just sleep shirts, stuff to sleep in. I'll show you the finished product once I get everything in here. Okay, I did it. I got everything to fit in here besides the ears, but I'm actually planning on putting those in Lydia's suitcase, I think. But I got all of my clothes and bathing suits and this little purse and these shoes to fit in here. So, yay! Now Lydia's suitcase is just about ready to go. So she's got some socks and then her undergarments are gonna go here. And this is a Marie shirt that she's wearing um, when we dress like Aristocats one day. She's got a Rapunzel dress. I feel like I, <laughs> I probably should have showed you guys this earlier. I packed this. This is one of the first things I packed. She's got a Jessie shirt for Toy Story Land. And then we've got some pajamas, a couple of pairs here. These are super cute. I love these Toy Story pajamas. It has like fuzzy shorts. And then just some extra shirts and some shorts at the very bottom. And then I think I'm going to be able to put these ears in this part of the suitcase. And since this is going to be a carry-on, I think it'll be okay. And hopefully they don't get smushed. Those actually seem to fit in there okay. I've got a little bit of tissue and bubble wrap in between some of them. So that's what that looks like. Now here is Miles' suitcase. His is packed a little more full because I needed to bring his swim float thingy. So we've got that in there, but I got it to fit. He wanted to bring his Donald Duck hat back that he had from the last trip. And then we just have all of his shirts. So this is his Aristocat shirt, it's a Thomas O'Malley shirt, and then his little Flynn Rider shirt. Let's see, we have some pajamas down here. And then he has a Buzz Lightyear shirt that he's gonna wear to Toy Story Land, a Hakuna Matata shirt from um, Animal Kingdom. Then some extra t-shirts just to have some non-Disney stuff, just random stuff, Buzz Lightyear shirt. And let's see, and there's a Star Wars shirt and then his shorts on the bottom. And then we've got socks and underwear and I think that's it for him. 
Oh, and the reason why we're bringing this is because, so usually at the Disney pools, they have little life vests that the kids can use, but almost every time we go, they're all taken, and all that's left are the big adult ones. So this time we decided to go ahead and bring this so he can definitely swim in the water on his own. So this big suitcase has just a bunch of random things in it. So I'm actually gonna end up putting one of the booster seats down inside of this one. It's in the car right now, but I'll get that when we get to the airport, I guess. I don't know how I'm gonna do that exactly, but it will fit with these things. I try not to pack this too full. So I am bringing these two lounge fly bags that I have. Um, I hate that it takes up so much room, but it's like, you know, you want to take them to Disney, right? That's the main, the main reason why you have them. And then these bags just have snacks in them. Um, this is my little pin folio that I'm going to use for pin trading. Here's the pins I have in here. I just plan on maybe trading with the cast members. I don't plan on doing any like big pin trading. So I mostly have little like mystery pack pins. And then the kids are gonna bring their pins too on their lanyards and put those in their carry-on bags probably. And then I have a couple umbrellas here. I debated on bringing these or not because I do have ponchos too, but I don't know. I think I'm gonna go ahead and bring those. Um, This is just an extra pack of flushable wipes. Let's see, up here I have the kids' goggles. I have some mouthwash and toothbrushes. Of course, I'll put all the toiletries in here tomorrow morning after we use them. This is one of my hair product things. This one is just sunscreen. And then I also made up this bag of different medicines and band-aids and stuff. I think this is gonna end up going in this bag. Um, but I, let's see, I have band-aids, elderberry syrup, I have, um, like Pepto-Bismol type stuff. Oh, and motion sickness medicine. This is mainly for me, so I can hopefully ride Flight of Passage without getting sick. Some children's ibuprofen, some Excedrin, some nighttime sleep aid for myself, and I think that's it. Oh, and then I also have these vitamins that the kids have been taking, these vitamin C and zinc vitamins. Now this is going to be my carry-on bag. I have a bathing suit for myself in here. Okay, so if we're using the Magical Express and Disney service where they bring your bags to your hotel room, it takes them three hours to deliver them. And if we wanna go swimming right away, I thought it would be good to go ahead and have some swimsuits. This is one of Miles. And I need to grab Lydia's. It's still wet right now, but I need to grab one of hers. All right, let's see. I have, these are my face wipes that I like to use. Some extra underwear for myself. This bag has like a few snacks. This bag is a toiletry bag. I went ahead and put this stuff in little bottles for the plane. I want to have this stuff right away, so I went ahead and put it in my carry-on, but my shampoo and conditioner, you know, just in case I want to take a shower after swimming and I want to wash my hair right away. This is sunscreen, so I have bigger bottles, but I went ahead and poured a little bit in here so we would have it right away. My foundation, I want to have some of my makeup in my carry-on, um, hand sanitizer and hand sanitizer. Then a little container of Wet Ones hand wipes, colored pencils and coloring books for myself, and some extra flushable wipes. This is our Magical Express paperwork. And in the very front, I have some lip gloss. I wonder if I should put that in here with this stuff maybe. And then let's see, this is another little sunscreen, but this is just a little sunscreen stick. I really like this stuff. It works really well and it smells really good too. I have some gum and our magic bands and my wallet. All right, let's start with Miles' bag. <laughs> All right, so he's got, I told him he could bring some stuffies and he's obsessed with stuffies. He definitely had to bring some. He has poo, he wants to bring this to Crystal Palace and then he brought a green alien. He's got a few books in here. Okay, in the front, here's where he has his entertainment stuff. So I got him this little Dumbo book with crayons in it. I thought this was really cute. And let's see, he has an Imagine Ink book, a Toy Story 4 play pack and a Connect the Dots book. Okay, and Lydia's bag. I think this is the last thing. All right, so she's got her little neck pillow. I actually got one of these for Miles too, but I guess he's gonna carry it or something. So she has an LOL surprise play pack, a fancy Nancy play pack, a connect the dots book like the one I got for Miles. I found these on Amazon. They love connect the, connect the dots. So I thought that these would be really cool. Um, she has a princess coloring book. She has some colored pencils here. Oh, she has her Jessie doll. I'm kind of surprised that she's bringing that. <laughs> then it looks like she has a bunch of books in the front. Let's see, upside down magic. Oh, she's got her money and her gift cards. 
Let's see, Anna and Elsa, Tangled book, Tinkerbell. Oh, and then her autograph book. I think that's it. I still have some more things to do. I never did do my nails. I took the old polish off, but I haven't put any new on yet. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to actually edit this video tonight and get it ready to go so I can post it while we are gone. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'm going to be posting Disney vlogs as soon as we get back from our trip. And I hope that you will tune in for those. I hope you enjoy them. I hope that this packing video gave you some ideas or you at least have fun watching it. I just enjoy watching packing videos because they get me excited for my trips coming up. Please leave me a comment and a like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye!